I feel like whenever there's a question that I could, could lean one way or the other, I'll answer it away from being autistic. And I really don't think it's because I don't want to be autistic. I think it's like I have this fear for some reason that I'm going to go into this assessment and because I'm there, she's going to think, okay, this person wants an autism diagnosis. And I feel like I'm going to somehow like manipulate the the assessment to like say I'm autistic if I'm not, which is just like a point of um, I just want like accuracy. That's really <laughs> what's going on there. So I when I like in my first six months discovery, I think I retook like the screeners, like the CAT-Q, the AQ, so the RADs, like times. so many times. And this time yeah. I was like, okay, I'm going to answer so conservatively. <laughs> like, <laughs> and I, I seriously probably took all of them like 10 or 20 times. And, and and with being with like, okay, well, I could say yes, but I could say no. So I'm going to say no this time. Yeah. <laughs> um, so yeah. I did the exact same thing. And it was, yeah. it was the like fear, again, that fear of like, I don't want to take up space and falsely claim this. Exactly. If I'm not right about this.